this is Anil with a video tutorial for the learning light on C programming so in this video tutorial we're gonna see some more information on functions so first we're gonna see how we can call a function from another function and then we're gonna see how the control will be transferred from one function to another function and how it will be returned so here for the demonstration purpose we're gonna use two other functions so first I'm gonna prototype it it's gonna be void function 1 and it's not going to take any parameter then another one is void function 2 and it also not going to take any parameters so here in this main function we're going to use a printf statement and we're going to say in main function then we're going to use another printf statement that's why I'm going to copy this and paste it here and we're going to say calling function 1 add a new line to both the printf functions so then we're gonna call the function 1 then again we're gonna say in main function after returning from function 1 and then we're gonna say finishing main function so now we need to uh, define this function 1 so it's gonna be void function 1 and it's not gonna take any parameter so we're gonna use another printf statement here and we're gonna say in function 1 and then we're gonna say returning from function 1 so from this function 1 we're gonna call the function 2 that's why it's gonna be function 2 and uh, before calling function 2 we're gonna print a message like okay I'm calling the function 2 that's why I'm gonna use a printf statement here and I'm gonna say calling function 2 and then after calling the function 2 you're gonna say in function 1 after returning from function 2 so this is it and the last thing we need to do for this tutorial is we need to define the function 2 it's going to be void function 2 and uh, here we're just going to use a printf statement and we're going to say um, in function 2 then we're gonna use the last printf statement in this program and we're gonna say returning from function 2 so this is it so what we have done here is we just call the function 1 from this main function then from that function 1 we call the function 2 and now we're gonna run this program and we're gonna see how this control was transferred from this main function to function 1 then this function 1 to function 2 so I'm gonna save it compile and run so it says in main function that's because when the program starts execution it begins from the main function that's why it's gonna say in main function then we call the function 1 that's why we are calling the function 1 then the control will be transferred to this function 1 to here so it's gonna print in function 1 then it says I'm calling the function 2 from this function 1 that's why it says calling function 2 then the control will be transferred to this function 2 from here in this function 2 it just prints in function 2 and at last it just returns from this function 2 so it says in function 2 and returning from this function 2 so when this function 2 returns it's gonna return to the caller of this function 2 that's the function 1 and then the remaining statements of this function 1 will be executed it's gonna print in function 1 after returning from function 2 so as you can see here in function 1 after returning from function 2 then it says I'm returning from this function 1 so returning from function 1 and this function 1 returns to its caller so here that's the main function which called this function 
1 that's why this function 1 is going to return to this main function so here you know when this control returns to this main function it's going to execute the other statement of this main function so it's going to print in main function after returning from function 1 that is this printf statement and then it prints finishing the main function so after that you know this get ch is just for adding a pause and uh, then it just uh, terminates our main function so this is it this is how we can uh, call a function from another function and this is how the control will be transferred from one function to another function so the notable thing here is when we call this function one this function one is called the called function and this main function is called the caller function so a caller function is the one which calls another function so a called function is one which is called by another function so here this function one is called function that's because it's been called by this main function so if we talk about this function one and function two then this function two is called function because it is called from this function one and this function one is a caller function so this is it this is about some information about the functions so thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe i'll see you in the next tutorial